Hi there and welcome to Lakey Collectibles. Right here I'm doing a review on something I picked up from the car boot. It's pretty cool I think. What I have here is a Board of Fine Arts a Special Edition Margaret Turner English Bull Terrier. It's a white female one. So anyone out there you know has got a white female English Bull Terrier this is just awesome. I had to buy, you know, the guy at the car boot, he did want quite a lot of money for it and I was quite, you know, reluctant to pay him, but seeing I have an English Bull Terrier as well, I had to buy it, you know. And luckily enough, when I did do the research on Google, it is a pretty rare edition, you don't see many of these down, even the Margaret Turner ones, they tend to be sitting down, you don't see many standing up ones. I did see a damaged one on eBay, going for about £11, I think it was, but that one was a broken one. This one's fully intact and I tell you what, I sculpt English Bull Terriers myself out of clay and things like that and I've got quite a lot of models and this is one of the most impressive English Bull Terrier sculptings I've ever seen. It's absolutely exquisite. Um, it was issued in 2001. It has EEGG Limited 2001 MT and I couldn't understand what the MT stood for but now I do know it's a Board of Fine Arts Margaret Turner Special Edition one and as you can see Hopefully my camera will pick this up in the light. The way the fur just moves into there, it's just absolutely awesome. I'd go around slowly, you can see, put all that detail in there. The craftsmanship from this is just absolutely stunning. You know, I don't normally get this worked up about ceramics, but when I saw this, as I say, the guy at the car boot, all he gave me was a pound off. He wanted quite a lot of money for it, and in the end, I had to have it. I will list it on my website, you know, but I'm not giving this away, you know, I'm not quite sure what I'm asking for it at the moment. I will decide and put it on my website in due time. But if you can just see the feet and everything, the detailing and everything, it's just absolutely stunning. It's a really, 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 really nice model. It's got the teeth at the bottom, and as you can see, obvious white to the <laughs> lady dog. Um, just a really, really, really nice piece. And as you can see the scale by my hand, it's quite a good size as well. This has no damage, it's absolutely in excellent condition. Unfortunately I don't have a box for it, it did come loose. Um, if anyone does like this, you know, from the time of me listing, give me a week or two, something like that, until I can finally get it on my website. And if anyone does want to purchase one of these, please check out my website, lowkeycollectibles.com. Subscribe, like, if you do like English Bull Terriers, you know, I do try and go out my way to buy them type of things because I just think they're the best dogs in the world. They're just absolutely awesome. And even when you have pictures or anything in your house, it just cheers your house up. They just look like, I don't know, happy kids. <laughs> so I am quite fond of these dogs. So if you do like English Bull Terriers, please check out my website because... That we do tend to do a lot of things and you know if people you know want cakes or stuff like that I don't mind making the little figurines out of icing cake I can do all that type of thing I think I've made that many English Bull Terrier sculptures now I, I can do them blindfolded but I must admit I can't make one this good this is really really good I tend to make you know cartoony ones or superhero ones but w someone who wants one which is really realistic this is absolutely awesome I shouldn't say this, but I'm inclined to get a 3D printer and print some of these out and actually spray paint them, you know, all different colours. Unfortunately, they only come white. And what I would do is I would get a 3D printer, put this in the printer, print it out. This is me personally. And I would make a brindle one like me out of this mould here. Anyway, thanks for looking. Bye-bye.